There's a new dedicated mining GPU on the block. NVIDIA is releasing their P102100, which is a mining version of their GTX 1080 card. Here's one from Zotac and another one from NO3D. These look to be the two first on the market here. And there are some hash rate estimates out for it. Ethereum at hash at around 47 mega hash. Zcash, Equihash around 660 souls. And Monero, Kryptonite at around 879 hashes a second. So this is looking like around two AMD 580s in hash rate for Ethereum and for Zcash. Uh, not that great of gains here on the Monero algorithm, Kryptonite. But it says here it's a two and a half times improvement over the Ethereum hash rate of a GTX 1080. Now the t max TDP is 250 watts. It'll be interesting to see how many watts, how much power is needed to get these hash rates that they have calculated out here. Uh, but for me, you know, these are dedicated mining cards, so you can only resell them to miners. You can't sell them to ga gamers. There is no display inputs on them. So to me, I would rather get an RX Vega series card. And for First Mining Rig does say they have 36 of the Zotax in stock at $1,320. So for that price, I'd much rather get a Vega. Just going off the prices here on First Mining Rig. The P102 is $1,320. And you can come down here and their RX Vega 56, 8 gig is $979. Which you can flash lease to the 64. And just looking at Buried Ones site. The RX Vega 64 overclocked. I've seen people even get better than this, but he's putting Ethereum ETH at 40 mega hash, Zcash at 475 souls overclocked, and Monero at almost 2,000 hashes a second overclocked. So a lot better here on the Monero. TDP is just a little bit higher than the P102, but with a Vega series card, you can resell them to gamers. Because it's not just a strictly mining card. So for me, it's nice to see they are making advances with mining cards. Two and a half times the improvement over Ethereum hash rate of the GTX 1080. But, you know, I expect a lot better than this from NVIDIA's upcoming series of cards. Their next generation, which should be coming sometime this year. So who really knows how long these will be profitable. Uh, to me, you know, it just looks like the hash rate and power draw of two RX 580s. So for the prices they're at, over $1,300, for me it's not quite worth it, but you might think something different. So that's it. That is the P102. It is now out. It is the GTX 1080 version mining card from NVIDIA. So that's it for this one guys. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to drop a like on the video. If you're new to the channel, subscribe and hit that notification bell. But I'll see you guys in the next one. As always, stay living that crypto money life.